I have this Americana sparkly hat that came from the Dollar Tree and I'm going to use my straight edge and a tape measure to just find the center of the top portion of the hat. Then I have these wall tiles. They came from the Dollar Tree. I'm going to be using three of them and I'm just adding the wall tile to the top portion of the hat, not the rim. Now when you line them up, you can make sure that the design all lines up evenly. And then I'm just going to use a razor blade to cut off the extra wall tile. Then I'm going to place the third one in the top right corner of the hat. And then I'm going to, again, use my razor blade to cut off the extra wall tile. So this is what we have so far. I'm going to cut anything that's by the rim as I just want that top portion covered. I'm going to use my painter's tape to create some stripes. You can even use a thinner painter's tape if you want thinner stripes, but I used this thicker one and it worked perfectly fine. And I'm going to leave the top left portion of the hat uncovered. Once I have my painter's tape laid down, I'm going to take my Wise Owl Bowie paint and paint that top left portion of the hat and the rim of the hat as well. I'm going to allow that to dry and I gave it two coats. I'm going to remove that one piece of painter's tape and now in the exposed areas that are left, I'm going to use Wise Owl Republic Red. This is a dry brush. I do not want full coverage as I wanna be able to see some of that gold and design through the red. I'm then going to lift up the painter's tape and you want to do this very slowly. I glued some stars in the top left portion. I added a little messy bow to the bottom. I took some burlap and I'm just going to kind of crisscross them using hot glue to adhere everything. And then I have this half bead that I glued on top of that. I created another hole in the wall tile. I'm just using my leather hole punch. And then I'm gonna add a hanger to the top. I have these artificial berries and I'm going to string it through the hole on the left and on the right. And there you go, I've upcycled this Dollar Tree decor and I really like how this came out. Thank you so much for watching. Paint products, tissue paper, transfers, and mesh stencils can be found over on our webpage at chalkandfancy.com. Have a great day.